In this video, we'll give you a brief overview of how to install Cherney's Airlock Manhole Tester. Remember, always fully read your manual for a detailed description of installation techniques and safety concerns. Step 1. Remove the manhole cover and place the manhole tester in the manhole chimney. Step 2. Adjust the cross brace so the sealing element will seal against the manhole ring. This adjustment is done by moving the pin and flat washer on the support rod. The manhole tester must be in this position to create a proper seal. Step 3. Inflate the manhole tester sealing element to 55 PSI. Step 4. Attach the suction hose to the coupling. Before testing, be sure to be out of the danger zone. Fully read your manhole tester manual for a full list of safety instructions. First, prime and start the engine. Next, open the ball valve to pull a vacuum in the manhole. Then, close the ball valve and monitor the vacuum for the specified test period. If the vacuum drops less than one inch of mercury within the test time, the manhole is considered acceptable and passes the test. If the manhole fails and leaks, make the needed repairs and test again until satisfactory results are obtained. Finally, to disconnect from vacuum pump, shut engine off, turn three-way valve to vent the hose releasing the vacuum, disconnect the hose when vacuum gauge reads zero. Connect vacuum port on generator to hose assembly. Connect vacuum hose and readback hose with gauge to manhole tester plate. Make sure the vacuum ball valve is in the closed position. Connect the air supply port on the generator to the output hose from the compressor. Pressurize the output hose from the compressor. Open the ball valve on the vacuum generator to pull a vacuum per ASTM C1244 or other testing standards. Close vacuum inlet ball valve and monitor vacuum for the specified time period. If the vacuum does not drop in excess of 1 inch HG over the specified time period, the manhole is considered acceptable and passes the test. To disconnect vacuum generator from manhole tester, depressurize the compressor output hose, open the ball valve, then disconnect the vacuum generator when the vacuum gauge reads zero. For more information, please contact your Cherney representative.